still in business, the Postmaster General of the Federation and Chief Executive Officer of Nigerian Postal Service, NIPOST, at DBC Adigui, says there is no conflict between NIPOST and the Federal Inland Revenue Service. The Postmaster General, while clearing the air of a lead drift between both revenue generating agencies, said the reports are untrue and the production and sale of stamp duties remain the sole responsibility of NIPOST. I think we were speaking to newsmen in Abuja said that NIPOST is undergoing a digital transformation phase in order to enable it to compete with its pairs globally and therefore it has moved from the sale of manual to electronic stamps. He added that NIPOST has been able to generate about 45 billion naira in the last one year. Must any agency of government and indeed any subnational government be allowed or be given responsibility to print stamps, postage stamps. It's not done anywhere in the world. It is a sign of our national identity, our sovereignty, and it's the exclusive responsibility of the federal government of Nigeria to be exercised by its parastata, established by law, to produce, print, manual, and electronic stamp. It is the problem of the law and excellent regulations that you must affix a manual post system to instrument, documents, and what have you. That we are not doing in the past does not mean the law has changed. That we are now ready to do it does not mean the means of denoting it should change. This government is about to invest in the post in through the um, partial commercialization, BP, and appointed a world class transaction advisor, KPMG. That's enough evidence. But the truth of the matter is even this. Government before President Mamadou Bari didn't see any need to do anything with the post because we were making money from oil. The Honorable Minister of Finance uh, told the Nigeria public, uh, I think about a week ago, how much has accrued to that account. But interestingly, it is the Postmaster General that is in charge of the said account we are talking about. So the Postmaster General, we, uh, we want to tell you today that what is in that account as at, as at Friday of last week, Friday 13th of December, is 45.8 billion. 45.8 billion, not 43 billion, as, as earlier mentioned, because the, the, the account was created in the name of NIPOS to collect the 50 50 naira charges, which are different from what the Federal Revenue Service is collecting, different from what the State Board of Internal Revenue Services are collecting.